Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Fandom Strategies. Uh, so I want to have a quick video on Ethereum. Right now it's trading at 172. Uh, we are seeing some momentum right now in the market, uh, especially in Ethereum. Uh, it's up about 7% right now. And uh, it's coming to the um, uh, near-term resistance, which is right around 192, 193. Um, it was a previous support back in late 2018 but now we are uh, coming right against that um, and if we can get out of that um, resistance the ceiling on uh, around 192 we can easily see um, 200 plus uh, and around maybe uh, 240 and uh, 250 in near term so ethereum um, it's trying to get out of his uh, uh, it's trying to break is uh, the downward pattern trying to get out of it and especially right now I'm looking at a weekly chart so um, it's looking at the broader picture looking at a longer term view uh, so if we can get out of this uh, 192 193 um, resistant in ethereum we can easily go toward 240 250 in short term all right uh, let's quickly look at the daily chart daily chart again uh, seeing a nice uptick in today's trading um, Again, it's around up seven percent, and we are coming near that. Um, the concession that we, uh, the support levels that we were seeing before, so we are coming right over uh, 192. That's that's the area that uh, we will see some um, some push and pull action um, fairly soon. But if we can get over that, um, definitely have this 240 in the card, 240, 250 and ethereum and car fairly soon all right um overall the market is quite flat today um litecoin uh, we have talked about it in previous video i uh, had some pullback but it's still looking rather good i mean it is still a lot of moving average support in the longer time frame so i'm not overly concerned about that right now um it is sitting on the, a lot of uh, moving average support um some other coins that I'm also keeping an eye on right now is, uh, you know, Tron is kind of just moving up and down. It's just trying to figure out whether it wants to, like, again, go sideways or want to break out. But, again, this kind of coin, once it breaks out, it, it, it have a pretty nice uptick. It can easily go 30-40% within a week. Uh, so do keep an eye on Tron as well. Um, uh, but, yeah, right now... Ethereum just popped out on my radar, um, so just wanted to bring you a quick video. Overall, um, things are consolidating right now, and I, I mean, I think there's some. The summer will be quite. I think it should be better than like what we have seen in the past in crypto market. So, um, and it, in Bitcoin, we are up against a lot of um, resistance, which was previously uh, support. So. Um, do keep an eye on those level as well in Bitcoin 58, 5900. Those are the resistance level in Bitcoin right now. Previously, they were at uh, the support level, so we definitely need to get over that. We are we are about the 50-day moving average on the weekly, which is a very positive sign. If we get positive momentum in the market, we can easily see 6500 in Bitcoin um, coming within this month. Okay. So that's a quick and short video for today. I mainly wanted to cover Ethereum um, since I'm seeing nice uptick in it today. Um, so hopefully uh, if you have the trade in Ethereum or if you're planning to trade, this will help. Um, it is. It does have a nice support as well from the moving average. So the stop loss I would keep in Ethereum would be around 155. If you are starting a new position or if you already have existing position, uh, that would be a good stop loss for Ethereum um, to be on the safer side. On the upside, it can go up to uh, 250. And that's the, up, uh, the the target one for Ethereum right now. Um, especially looking at the current market, it can easily do that within a couple of weeks. All right. Uh, that's all for today, guys. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. Um, feel free to email, uh, post a comment. If you have anything other, any other question, any other coins you want me to look at, uh, post it in the comment. All right. Talk to you soon.